Hey guys, what is going on? It is the Trusty Gamer here bringing you some Modern Warfare 2 Live. Now you might be wondering, why are you bringing me Modern Warfare 2 Live? That game is uh, old from 2009, 2010. Why are you playing this on your channel? And the reason I'm playing this on my channel is because I'm talking about my start in gaming. And that's absolute bullshit. I should have had that go. Look at how many times I shot the damn guy. But, um... I'm going to be talking about my start in gaming today, and I believe that Modern Warfare 2 kind of sums up my start in gaming pretty well, because it was really my first Call of Duty and my first, it's not my first gaming experience, because it wasn't my first, uh, you know, game that I'd ever played or whatever, but it was the first time that gaming really evolved for me, and that was probably because of the, the social aspect of Modern Warfare 2, um, you know, we had... We had a PlayStation 2. My family had a PlayStation 2. Um, but the online on that, I mean, it really wasn't implemented at all. Um, you know, it was there, but it really wasn't at the same time. And then when the Xbox 360 dropped, uh, I didn't have it right off the start because, um, you know, I was still young. And when I got the Xbox 360, Modern Warfare 2, I believe, was the, was the main title when I got um, the the Xbox. I, I I was looking at dates and I just I really couldn't uh couldn't remember what uh what was what but hold on. Oh boy. Um so th like like I said that was my first really social aspect. Um I got a Xbox 360 because my friends had Xbox 360s and then I proceeded to get Modern Warfare 2. And this was my first time playing a social shooter. I had played uh god, I think I played COD 4 on the PS2. I believe I had that. Um but I didn't uh, you know, I didn't I didn't have any online, so you know, I'd play the campaign or, or or whatever else. So, you know, I got the game and um that was really when my start in um video or not not video games, but my start in kind of live streaming started that's when i first started live streaming was when modern warfare 2 was out i had an easy cap you know like the three dollar webcams that they are not webcams three dollar capture cards that they sold i had one of those and a core 2 duo laptop and um that was like my first like i guess you could say almost like youtube experience except it wasn't youtube it was um justin tv at the time and you know, I was young then, and that was really what kind of whole st was started my whole, you know, gaming career, I guess you could say. Because, you know, I, I had the, the friends on the, the system um, that I, you know, I, I knew. And it, w it was a whole new experience to be able to, you know, not play a single player game, but to sit here and be like, hey, uh, Paul, you know, what's up? You know, we're, we're, we're just sitting here, we're talking. And we're we're playing a game together. We're playing an objective-based game, and you know that was that was fun and all. So the it it's it's weird to think that you know a game like this, which you know Modern Warfare Two, when it was launched, I mean it was broken as all hell. I mean we had the care package glitch, we had the javelin glitch, we had tenth prestige people, um, we had hackers galore. It was just it. You know, it was it was a good and bad experience at the same time. You know, it was a bad experience because, like, I would say at least once a week, you were in a lobby with somebody that had a, some kind of, you know, AC-130 hack or, 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 you know, some other bogus hack like that. And it was like, you know, no matter what you did, you were in these, like, hacked lobbies. You know, you'd, you'd get thrown in these lobbies with, uh, you know, all these people that, you know, would try to s sell you 10th Prestige, but like, you know, 1600 Microsoft points for, for 10th Prestige or, or whatever else. So, it was a good and bad time at uh, at the same time, and, and you know, it was fun. It, it, I would rather have had a game like this that, you know, the, the lag comp issues weren't there. Um, you know, look, I, I'm getting kills right now, and I'm not putting 90 bullets into people. You know, I'm putting 4 or 5 bullets into people and getting kills, which, and, and that's what it should be. So it was a good learning experience because it was like, hey, you know, it's right here. 
Um, it's it's not extremely hard. I mean, my K I looked at my KD before I started playing. My KD was like point five, um, but it was it was a very uh, I guess you could say inspiring time. And I know this like, sounds weird, like you know, like you know, video games are all that. But it 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 like it changed my whole um, experience with video games. Like before that, I was like, oh, it's just a video game. Um, but then I, you know, got this, and I was still, t still absolutely garbage at it, as you could see me missing the, uh, the predator there. But let's let's try to get this care package. Um, so you know, it was a really cool time. That, like I mentioned, I was, I had a, I would say, pretty successful Justin TV channel at the time as well, too. I mean, Justin TV was small, uh, very, very small community and all that fun stuff. But I had a pretty successful channel, being, um. As, as old as I was, you know, I had lots of people watching. It was a model for doing a great time, but I never got into YouTube. And I, I really think that was a mistake. But, you know, at the time, I didn't have a microphone. I just had, you know, a $3, um, um, you know, recorder. I, you know, I didn't have a, a PVR or anything like that. Uh, so I, I had nothing to, uh, you know, really, really record with. So that's why I wasn't doing YouTube. But, you know, I do. Ha it was just. The experience with with Modern for Two was just something that I don't think any other Call of Duty is ever going to be able to to you know re redo. I guess uh, it, it would be the right word for it. You know, no no other Call of Duty is going to be able to to re emulate this experience of you know the the social aspect of gaming along with you know a decent game that isn't like ridiculous like like you know the the current generation Call of Duty is um, so. It's, it was just a huge point in my life. Uh, you know, I had I, ha I had friends playing the game, and it was uh, just generally a uh, a good time for uh, for you know gaming and social uh, interaction stuff like that. So uh, yeah, this this is Modern Warfare 2. That was my my start in gaming, uh, basically in a nutshell, right there. Um, and that's really all I have to say about it. As I mean, you know, without without a game like Call of Duty, I I was changed as as a as a gamer, um, and you know, it, it did affect my life because it was like you know, this is fun. I don't just have to sit there and play solo campaign for you know a year while I wait for the next game to come out. So thanks for watching, guys. I hope you enjoyed my little um, experience with Modern Warfare Two live commentaries uh, talking about you know, getting back into the game, uh, not really getting back into the game, but talking about my, my first experience with it. Hope you enjoyed. Don't forget to like the video, subscribe to the channel for more, and, uh, maybe we'll have some Modern Warfare 2 content in the future. Thanks for watching, guys.